Buongiorno, benvenuti. Oggi we'll cook a delicious dish from the northwest of Italy, a region called Lombardia, and the dish is called gli gnocchi. At the same time, you will learn Italian. Today we start with the very basic one, but as we progress, you'll learn more and more. I want to introduce you Maria, my friend and student. Ciao Maria! Ciao Roberta! Benvenuta! Grazie! Maria, are you ready to cook gnocchi today? Mm. Ok, are you ready to speak some Italian? Certo! Oh, pronta? Sì! Si. Ok, Maria, I will show you some ingredients we're gonna use, ok? D'accordo! Allora, la cipolla, la cipolla, brava, la carota, la carota, il sedano, le uova, il parmigiano, la farina, la farina, il burro, il burro, brava, il rosmarino, il rosmarino, la noce moscata, la noce moscata. Sì. Che cos'è la noce moscata, Roberta? La noce moscata è nutmeg. Ah, ok. Il pepe. Il pepe. Il sale. Il sale. Brava. L'olio. L'olio. Mm -hmm. We don't say olive oil because olio, olive oil is what we cook all the time with. Just. So we just say olio, like parmesan cheese, parmigiano, olio, olio. Just a little information before starting. The gnocchi we're making today are the gnocchi with broth, brodo. So really nice and delicious, especially with the cold wind outside. How we do them? Let's start with the brodo. So uh, we're going to put the ingredients. First, we turn up the fire. So la cipolla, uno, due, tre, quattro, cinque, sei, sette, otto, nove, un po' di rosmarino, dieci e naturalmente un po' di sale. E Maria, I gotta tell you a little trick that my grandma told me when I was a little girl. This is parmigiano, it's the whole parmigiano, not the grated one. So if we cut the parmigiano, the crust, la crosta, and we put this in the broth, oh, it's, going, really? yeah, it's going to give a very, very nice mm. flavor to the stock. Excellent, I always throw mine away. No, Maria, don't do it. Just never keep again. it, never again, and put it in the broth. Now, the next step is to get the butter melted. So we're going to put the butter now in the pentola, in the pan. He has to melt. We keep the pan, the pentola, a little bit away from the fuoco, fire, because we want the, bu the butter to melt, not to burn. Now that it's a little bit as melted, can go down again on the fire. We can leave it there. The broth is looking good. See, si, it smells buono. 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 Si, buono. 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 Il brodo. Maschile. Now we go to the next step. We gotta deal with the uova, con le uova. Le uova. Sì, we have to open, aprire le uova, but we only need the yolk now. We, don't, we leave the white out, il bianco of the eggs okay. out. Go ahead, Maria. Shall I crack this into si, here? Sì, 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 sì. We do one each. That's fine. Allora, the next step is to put four cucchiai Spoons di parmigiano. Come dice? Cucchiai. Cucchiai. Sì, Spoon. sì. Cucchiai. Di parmigiano qui. Quindi big cucchiai. So maybe we're gonna have a little bit more. Again, this adds flavor, but also it's proteins. Parmesan mm -hmm. is really, really good for our bones. So let's make sure we have parmesan every day. The butter, il burro è pronto, è ready, pronto, quindi mettiamo il burro qui dentro, ecco qua, mm. e con un cucchiaio again, you can please start uh, girare, okay. girare, sì, grazie. How do you say that? Girare. Girare, sì. to stir, sì. ok. Quindi gira, gira, brava Maria. A little bit of time because we don't want it too lumpy. Ok, benissimo. Mm, e smells buono. 
sì, molto buono. E adesso dobbiamo mettere il bianco, the white ah. of the eggs. I'll do a little bit, yes, please. Due. Sì, 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 tutte e due, brava Maria. Okay. Quindi noi giriamo until, you see, it's, it's ready, because mm, it all comes good. together, yeah. And adesso guardiamo il brodo, which is pronto, ready, pronto. È pronto. Sì, sì, so what we do, we pick up with the spoon a little bit of this impasto, with our finger we give a little bit of round shape and we drop it in the brodo. Maria, as soon as the gnocchi come to the surface, they're ready to be served. So as you see, it's very easy, very quick. It won't take more than a few minutes. Excellent. So in the meantime, we can keep putting the gnocchi balls in the broth. Okay. Make sure you give it a nice round shape, otherwise it will look a little bit odd in the plate, in the dish. Don't burn your finger. It's okay. Yeah, that's fine. So this one's made of flour rather than the potato. Yes, flour, okay. that's great. Eggs, uova, some parmesan, burro, butter, nutmeg, because the nutmeg gives the flavour. But the most important thing to give a dish a good flavour is the broth, as well as the sauce, if you're using the sauce, maybe, let's say, for the pasta and stuff. Maria, while they're cooking, let's do some Italian. Okay. Okay, so now we'll try to learn how to introduce ourselves. Maria, just repeat after me. Mi chiamo. Mi chiamo. Okay, mi chiamo Roberta. Mi chiamo Maria. Bravissima Maria. So if I want to ask you the question, it would be come ti chiami? Come ti chiami? Brava, quindi come ti chiami? Mi chiamo Maria. Bravissima. Come ti chiami? Mi chiamo Roberta. Benissimo, sì. Maria. And if I want to ask somebody else's name, let's say, what's your friend's name, I would say, come si chiama? Come si chiama? So, that's well done. So, mi chiamo Roberta, ti chiami Maria, and let's say we have a friend whose name is Carla, si chiama Carla. Si chiama Carla. Benissimo, Maria. D'accordo. Quindi, gli gnocchi sono pronti. We add some more parmigiano on top of the gnocchi because, of course, it gives more flavor. It looks delicious. Can you smell it? Mmm, it smells delicious too. Yes, and they're ready to be eaten. Mmm. Com'è? È buono. Buono. Mmm, I'm really happy with that. So, I hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. I hope you learned how to make this delicious, easy, fast, healthy gnocchi. And I hope you learned some Italian as well. Maria, let's brindiamo, how my grandma would say, alla salute. Alla salute.